Hi there everybody, 53 plays here. Welcome to part 38 of Paper Mario. We just did a whole bunch of favors for Koopa Koot here, we are all done with that. Now we're gonna go ahead and deliver all the letters we have in our inventory. We have six letters right here, and unfortunately one of them is gonna be a big chain of letters. Starting with, uh, I think it was uh, Goompapa right here. So. Let's go ahead and let's look at the first one. I think I was, was talking and skipped over him. The first one here is in Rusty. It, it goes to Rusty in Toad Town. So we're going to go ahead and take out Paracarry. And we're going to go ahead and meet you at Rusty's house. We'll be right there. Okay, here we are in Rusty's house. Let's go ahead and talk to him. Oh, salutations. You're Mario, are you not? Of course I know who you are. I'm the wise toad, Rust T. Pleasure meeting you. As you can probably tell, I love books and read them all the time. Because I'm so well read, I know all sorts of interesting facts. Whenever you visit with me, I'll be happy to share all of my knowledge with you. You are Mr. Rust T, correct? My name's Paracarry. I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. Also, Paracarry, whenever you deliver, when you deliver letters, he'll say uh, something different uh, each time he starts. So, like, here he says, You are Mr. Rust T. Um, he'll sometimes say, like, like, um, Igor from Boot Shop. That's the name, right? So something like that. So let's give him this letter. And, he, and he'll usually say, another letter do we deliver. The postman's job is never done. Now what could this be about? Hmm, it's from Lava Lava Island. It's a, it's a question from a curious kid there. My mind is quite in demand. Thank you, Paracarry. I thank you for your quick delivery. I don't usually accept questions, but oh well. It's from a kid, and we must educate the younger generation. When I was a child, I had a curious mind as well. Still do. I'll get right on the answer. Thanks again for bringing this letter in such a long way. Please take this as a thanks. A star piece. So with these uh, letters, usually we're going to get star pieces as uh, gifts uh, when we deliver them. Um, but on one of them, namely the uh, chain of letters, we're going to get something bigger than a star piece at the end. So, we knocked that one off our list. Let's take a look at the next one. To Mayor Penguin, let's actually deliver that a little, later, a little bit later. Let's take this one to Merlo at Shooting Star Summit. Actually, hold on, Min T. Let's give this one to Min T first, since she's uh, just right over here. You're Min T, correct? Name's Paracarry. So yeah, we'll take the one to Mayor Penguin a little bit later. Because um, one of the, one of the uh, letters in the chain is going to go up to Shaver City. To me? Who's it from? The Wise Wisterwood. Who's Wise Wisterwood? Thank you for making the flowers bloom so beautifully. Oh, it's a thank you note. It says, please drop by Flower Field sometime. Wow, how delightful. But how does Wise Wisterwood know about me? That's strange. Oh, excuse me, I'm rambling. This is a small gift to say thank you for delivering the letter. Please take it. Another star piece. Okay, so, let's see what else we have. We have... Papa, we have Igor and Boo's shop. Um, we'll save that one for a little bit later. Let's go to Merlo. Yeah. You are Merlo, correct? Name's Paracarry, I deliver letters. Alright, so now we have this letter delivered. And let's see what he says. A letter for me from Merle in Starborn Valley from news from my dad. Thanks, Mr. Postman. My dad deliver my dad writes all the time because he worries about me. My sisters and I are totally about writing back though. Are totally bad about writing back though. Maybe I ought to write him a little more often, huh? This is a treasure that I've gonna that I've kept for a long time. I'm gonna give it to you as a thanks. You could always come back and swap me something for it. Who is it a star piece? Yes, it is a star piece. Okay, so now we have three letters left. One to Mayor Penguin, one to Igor and Boo's shop. And one to Goompapa. So I'm actually going to go ahead and start the one to Goompapa. Because that actually, I'm going to spoil it, is the letter, um, is the chain letter. So I'm going to go ahead and leave and meet you all the way back at Goomba Village to start this chain of letters. I'll be right there. Okay, here we are in Goomba Village. Um, this is Goompapa, who we need to talk to. You're Goompapa, correct? The name's Paracarry. I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. I read kind of fast there. 
Another letter Dewey delivered. A postman's job is never done. Hey, thanks. Much obliged, Mr. Postal Worker. Great news! Fishing is one of my hobbies, and this is from a friend who's planning a fishing trip. I can't wait. Oh, sorry to pile work on you, but I, could I give you a letter? Yeah, this is the chain of letters that, you, I, I, that I just spoiled for you. If it's at all possible for you, could you deliver this to a toad named Musty? He hangs around the castle garden. I'd really appreciate it. So we got the letter! A letter to Musty near Princess Peach's castle. So I will go ahead and meet you outside Peach's castle. Alright, here is the toad we're ta we need to talk to. You're Musty, correct? My name is Paracure. I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. Oh, it's from the Go it's Mr. Goompapa, that old codger. We think alike, he and I. It's been ages since I saw him. Too long indeed. This reminds me, I was just thinking about sending a letter to one of my other friends. Your timing is perfect. This, this letter is to my friend. His name is Cooper, and he lives in Koopa Village. I'd like you to deliver this to him. I'll bet he's near the entrance to the village. He usually hangs out in front of the toad house that's right on the edge of town. No big rush, but it would be nice if he got it soon. Okay, so this letter is now going to go to uh, Coover at the entrance to Koopa Village. So we're going to go ahead and take the sewers down to Koopa Village and deliver this to that old Koopa. I will see you there. It's been a while since I've been shopping in Toad Town. I bet I could read all about your adventures in the newspaper there. Another letter duly delivered. A postman's job is never done. Hey, thanks. You came at a good time. I was just about to send a letter myself. Oh, would you look at this? It's a letter from Musty. The two of us are always thinking about along the same lines. He's one of my fishing pals. I'll tell you, if you don't fish, you should. What a hobby. And to think I was just about to send letters to all my fishing buddies about a trip. Once we have a good place to set up, I'll write a letter back to Musty. So could you send this along for me? Thanks so much. It's to a friend of mine who's always fishing at the Toad Town port. He's easy to find. Thanks again. So now this letter will go to Fish Mail at the Toad Town port. He's the guy who always has the fishing rod in his hands, is usually with uh, the Fuzzy Pete. So I'll go ahead and uh, talk to him. Okay, here's Fish Mail. Addressed, yes, he, he says something different here. Addressed to a person living at the port. Ah, this must be you. The name's Paracary, I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. A postman's job is never done. Hmm? What's this, then? Shiver me timbers! Word from Coover! Must he said he wrote a letter, too. Everyone's got the fishing bug. Time for a fishing trip. You should come along, Mario. Yar, that reminds me. I got a favor to ask. Could you deliver this to him? Him? Why, the Koopa Troopa who's asked you to, to uh, bring this letter to me. Coover's the name. Yar, take good care. For the love of fishes. Okay, for the love of fishes. Gotta get those fishes now. Okay, even though I'm not a big fan of Bowdoin, Thugs, and Harmony, I just know of that song. So, um, we now need to go all the way back to Coover and take uh, that letter to him. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, here we are all the way back at Koopa Village with Coover. Mr. Coover, Paracary here. I have a letter for you. Hang on a minute. See, I told you this is a big chain of letters. It's not going to be done quite yet. Oh, thanks. Cool, it's from my pal. This must be the answer to my last letter. Thanks for the speedy delivery. Now I can send letters to the whole gang. It'll be great meeting up with all the guys and fishing up a storm. I've already written one. Here, can you take it? It's to Mr. It's to Mr. E. Mr. E. Wow. Who lives in the desert. He, he'll most likely be hanging out in front of the toad house. He wears a blue turban. You'll probably notice him right off the bat. Thanks for everything. We got the letter. Oh man, all the puns in this name, in this game. It's very, very punny. Boo. You can go ahead and boo that. So, uh, <laughs> so we gotta take this letter now to Mr. E, who lives in Dry Dry Outpost. He's in front of the Toad House, as Coover just said. So, he is through this warp pipe, and the Toad House, um, was over here, wasn't it? No. It's on this side of uh, the town. Yep, right here. I haven't seen rain in ages. I know, I know it's a desert, but it should rain once in a while. I made a wish to the stars for a little moisture, but I guess it didn't help. You're 
Mr. E, correct? My name's Paracary, I deliver letters. Alright, postman's job is never done. Gee, thanks, Look, it looks like an order from Koopa Village. My job is delivering things from Dry Dry Outpost. This guy's a great customer, he's always ordering stuff. Hey, by the way, would you do me a favor and deliver this letter to the next time you're in Toad Town? It's to Miss T. She lives there. She's one of three amazingly beautiful sisters. She's normally chatting with her sisters in front of the dojo. Thanks a lot. And actually, while we're down here, let's go ahead and check and see if our spell is still good. Um, I think after this part, we might go ahead and start uh, our final part of the game. So we're going to need that spell. Special Force, not Petite. Okay. So yeah, we're gonna need the spell big time for our last uh, fight here. Because after this part, we're gonna go ahead and finally go up to Peach's castle and stop Bowser once and for all. But until then, we are delivering letters with our good friend Paracarry. So, where is this? Oh, it goes to the uh, Misty in Toad Town. Alright, let's go ahead and take it to her then. Okay, it's not this one, it's the, this one, I think. You are Miss T, correct? My name's Paracarry. So yeah, I guess it's a little hard if you don't, if you don't use, like, if you haven't done, um, Gumbario's Tattle on these, uh, toads, you probably won't know who Miss T is right off the bat. But who is this from? I don't think I recognize the return address. Oh, well, I'm always getting love letters from strangers. I'm super popular. But enough about me, I'm so- it's so lucky you came just now, Mr. Postman. Will you do me a favor? I want you to deliver this letter to the shop owner at Dry Dry Outpost. I order lots of things for the desert, they have so much good stuff. It's not easy staying this beautiful, it takes work. Will you please deliver this? Thanks. Okay, so it goes to Little Mouser now. So, we gotta go all the way back to Dry Dry Outpost, to the item shop there. So, let's go ahead and deliver that. Be back in a jiffy. You know what, since we're here, let's go ahead and let's claim some of our items. Wait, actually, wait, hold on, did we, did we sell them? Wait a minute. Oh, actually, never mind. You're the owner of the shop, correct? Name's Paracure, I deliver letters. Oh, thanks. Yeah, this is an order sheet from one of my regulars. Good deal. She's one of my best customers. She orders things, she orders things all the time. If health and beauty are what you're after, you can't beat desert lemons and limes. You can find them in the oasis. Oh, if you make a juice with those things, mmm mmm. Oh, hang on. Almost forgot. Can you do me a favor? Please deliver this to a letter to a boo called Frankie. Frankie, actually, it's not Frank Lee. Frank Lee is from Thousand Year Door, but Frankie lives in a mansion way out on the far edge of Forever Forest. It may be tough to find him. Okay, so this goes to Frankie and Boo's mansion. Now let's go ahead and like, let's uh, wait, no, hold on. Yeah, okay, let's go ahead and let's actually sell these really quick. We don't need these anymore. Okay, dried pasta, and dusty hammer. Oh, wait, wait, no, wait, hold on. I pressed the wrong key. Alright, don't sell any more things. Let's go ahead and check, claim, some of our shrooms. The, let's get the, let's get the bland meal. And we need the life shrooms. And... Um, I'm not gonna get the maple syrup, because let's see how many things we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, we can also buy a life shroom, by the way. We can buy a life shroom at a Boo's Mansion, so we need to go all the way to Boo's Mansion now and deliver that letter to Frankie. You're Frankie, correct? Name's Paracurry, I deliver letters. Okay, I think we're at least halfway done with this uh, chain of letters here. Thank you! Oh, great, it's finally in! This is from a guy I know who deals in useful items from all over the world. He has a great eye for items. He just got something that I wanted for a long time. It's the coolest thing. I almost forgot, could you deliver this for me? Sorry if it's a bother. 
There's a toad uh, in Toad Town named Dane T. He's also, um, yeah, he, um, let's see, he's, yeah, I'll just stay. Dane T is over by the train station, and he's one of those little tyke toads, which is, uh, hanging around there. Since we're here, let's go ahead and buy a life shroom. Um, they do have, actually, life shrooms in, um, uh, the final dungeon, Peach's Castle, but I'm just gonna buy one here just in case. 50 coins. We can afford that, though. Wait, I pressed the B button. Dang it. Okay, so yeah, we've got a life stream there. We need to go to Dane T now, who is all the way up in Toad Town by the train station. So after this door, I'm gonna go ahead and meet you down there. Uh, well, my memory sure is pretty salty. I just went back into the sewers, but then I forgot we have a letter to Igor at Boo's shop. Yeah. I completely forgot about that, so I just I spent like two minutes doing nothing. So yeah, let's take this letter to uh, Igor here. Igor of Boo's shop, correct? Name's Paracarry, I deliver letters. Man, I can't believe I just I completely forgot about that letter. But yes, um, here it is. A letter? Oh, right, Norilis. Weird, this order's from Gusty Gulch. That's right around the corner. Can't they just come here? Oh well, my motto is, from boo to you with a smile. Take this for your trouble, and it's a start piece. Okay, so finally we can go to Toe Town and deliver that letter to, Tain D to Dane T. Okay, say goodbye to Boo's Mansion, we're not coming back here anymore. Okay, I believe this is Dane T. Let's go ahead and check. Yes it is, you're Dane T, correct? Thanks, mister. Wow, I mean, wow, it's an invitation to the Haunted Mansion. I didn't think it would really come. All the kids in Toad Town have been talking about this invitation, wondering if it was for real. But now that it's come, I, ha I guess I have to go. Mini T, are you brave enough to go with me? Uh, you know, I'm really kind of busy, and oh yeah, I just had the greatest idea. Let's ask that Yoshi kid from Yoshi's, Yoshi's Village to come. You just got a letter from that kid last week, didn't you? You don't. That letter you got from the island? Let's send a letter back to him and tell him about that scary adventure we're going to have. Hey, Mr. Postman, take this letter to, to, to the red Yoshi kid in Yoshi's Village. Alrighty, so now we got to go to Yoshi's Village, deliver this to the red Yoshi kid. I will meet you there. Okay, so here is the red Yoshi kid that he just talked about. A red Yoshi kid. Ah, you must be the one. Name's Pear Carry. I deliver letters. Thanks, I wonder what it is. Oh, my pal made up a new game. I gotta play this later. He also wants me to come over to his town and play with him sometime. But how can I get there? Oh well, maybe someday I'll be able to cross the sea and hang out. It's really funny, because I was just writing him a letter about a game I made up. Mr. Paracary, will you help? Here, deliver my letter to the Toe Town Kid who asked you to send this one to me. Could you? Thanks. Yes, another letter. We have to backtrack all the way back to Dainty again. So, I'll see you down there. Alright, Dainty. You're Dainty, correct? That's already Dainty, Mr. Pear Carry. Why are you... He's saying that. You just delivered a letter to him. Come on, Pear Carry. Wow, thanks a lot. You're much faster than the old postman, that's for sure. That Yoshi kid is really good pen pal, huh? He writes really long letters. It sounds like there's always something fun going on over where he is. Lucky Yoshi. We should write back again. Hmm, what do you think we ought to write about now? Hmm, I don't know. Let's think about it later. By the way, I want to ask you for a favor, Mr. Paracary. Can you deliver this? It's a letter for Uncle Frost T of Starborn Valley. He's my uncle. He's up there taking care of lots of star kids. It sounds like a hard job. He has to chase them around all the time. At least that's what he says in the letters he sends. Anyway, I wrote him a letter to take his mind off work. I know it's far from here, but I'd really appreciate it. So, now we have two letters, including that one. We have to take all the way up to um, Shiver City and Starborn Valley. So, let's go ahead and I'll meet you up in uh, Shiver City first. Okay, here's Mayor Penguin again. Mario, 
I do believe you saved all seven star spirits. Now all you have to do is defeat Bowser and bring back the star rod so that the world can be peaceful again. And all those poor kidnapped people can come back. I wish to the stars you'll win. You're, Mr. You're Mayor Penguin of Shiver City, correct? My name is Pear Carrie. I deliver letters. I have one for you. Hang on a moment. A minute. A moment. That was a fast animation there, by the way. Wow. For me? Oh, it's from Yoshi Village. I don't know where that is, but I bet it's pretty far away. I'll read this later. Thanks very much. Oh, hang on. I'll give you this. A star piece. Yes. It's not a chain of letters like the other one we're currently doing. So, this uh, last one we have, we only have one letter left. and That's our chain of letters. It goes to Frosty and Starborn Valley. So I'll go ahead and take this to him, and I'll meet you over there. Okay, I think this is Frosty right here. You're Frosty, correct? My name's Paracarry, I deliver letters. Okay, so, we're almost done with uh, this chain of letters, just for your information. Um, oh, thank you! How nice, it's a letter from Little Dainty and Mini T. Those naughty little rascals, when I visited their home, they are always up to something. They do write me letters often. It's nice to get letters. Their, na their mail makes me as happy as mail from my wife and daughter. Oh, yes, I almost forgot. I need a letter delivered. Yes, we're not done. I'd like you to take this letter to Goompapa in Goomba Village. It's actually a reply to little Goombaria, but I think her dad could explain it to her better. Drop it off whenever you have a chance, all right? Thank you so much. All right, now we're going all the way back to Goompapa in Goomba Village right now. And with this letter, thank you, sir. What would we do without postal service? Oh, how interesting! A letter from Gumbaria. I guess I could open it. I remember she wrote a letter just the other day, and I was wondering what it was. I was wondering what it was. I see. I guess it was a question. And this seems like the answer. It looks pretty complicated, but I think I understand. I'll tell her all about it. Thanks so much for the prompt delivery. Here, take this. Now, this is not a letter. Not a star piece. It is... The Lucky Day Badge. Sometimes makes enemies fail to attack Mario. And thus ends our chain of letters. Woohoo! We don't need you, Paracarry. So, after all that huge chain of letters going back and forth in between worlds, we get the Lucky Day Badge, and I believe it's a really expensive badge, too. Lucky Day. Seven MVP needed for the Lucky Day Badge. I mean, look, I mean, pretty lucky makes enemies fail to, fail to attack every once in a while, but Lucky Day sometimes makes them fail to attack Mario. Um, I'm not sure I'm going to be using that badge. Um, because it's really expensive. But I do like the, uh, the picture for that, though. Yeah. Okay, so, that concludes that, and that concludes this part, actually, of, uh, part 38. So, in the next part, I think what I'm gonna do is, um, I'm gonna go up to, um, off-screen, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, buy a badge for Merlo, which I think we're gonna need, actually, um, before we, um, go up to Bowser's Castle, because I'm going to do one um, specific thing with that badge in order to get some things done. So, until then, until part 39, this is 53 Plays, saying have a good day, and I'll see you in the next part.